Hello, it's Mr. Pierce here from the music department and I'm going to talk to you today a little bit about why GCSE music is such an excellent subject to our academy and to help you consider whether or not it is the subject for you. Plain and simply, if you can sing, if you can play an instrument or you're passionate about music, this is absolutely the subject for you. It's exciting, it's engaging, it's fun, you are doing all the time, you are exploring instruments, vo your voice, listening to a wide range of music every single lesson. It is so practical and so engaging. It's also very challenging, but that's why it's so rewarding. The course is tough, but because it's so practical and because you're composing and playing all the time, the rewards you get for that really challenging work are just so, so high. And we know that students who do this course, who commit to it, who love it, end up with just the most fantastic experience. Um, we make sure that on our GCM, GCSE music course, we are training you to become musicians. Yet we are not just training you to sit an exam or to study the qualification. We are training you to become musicians. That's why our lessons are incredibly practical. You are studying instruments, as I've said, you're using your voice all the time, you're using all of those resources down in the music department to become the best musician you can possibly be. And that includes composing and lots and lots and lots of performing, as well as some listening exercises as well. But because we've developed you as a musician through loads and loads and loads of practical work, you're going to find all those other things far easier and, and far more exciting. So as I've said, our subject is all about those practical lessons because we believe that's what makes the best musicians. But also, that's what, get, that's what gets excellent results. And historically, in the music department, we get excellent results for this reason. Furthermore, 60% of this qualification is non-exam, so it is not a sit-down written paper examination. OK, 40 percent of it is there's a listening paper, but most of your qualification is about your performance skill and about your composition skill. And in order to make sure you are as good as that as you can be, you get to work with our teaching staff, but also the peripatetic teachers that come in from the Walsall Music Hub to make sure that you are 100 percent ready to go in those performance and composition aspects which, as I've said, is 60% of your qualification. It's, it's such a huge percentage. OK, you will get a chance to sing or play in every lesson. It's just what we do. It's how we teach it. It's how it's we, we know it's how you get the most from it. And it's how you become as good as you can possibly be at music. So that's why we do it. You're also going to get the opportunity to create music. Composition is a really tricky skill and we do lots of work with you to make sure that you become super, super composers. So at the end of this course, you're not only going to have an excellent qualification and be a brilliant performer. You're going to have at least two pieces of music that you have written that are yours and that you've performed with your classmates or with your teachers or with the fabulous staff at Walsall Music Hub. A fantastic opportunity and again, a really rewarding experience. And also, um, if you're thinking about music, clearly you like listening to music. And what we do is we listen to a lot of music. We listen to music from loads and loads of popular music. There's a whole area of study all about pop, rock, dance music, etc. But then there's also units of work about musical theatre. And there's units of work about jazz music. And there's units of work, units of work about film music. And we watch extracts from films and analyse how the music is contributing to the action as well as looking at music in history as well. Basically, you get to experience music in every form and every way. In music, music technology and in performing arts. After that, you could go into university degrees in music, music technology and performing arts. And you should know that a number of Brownhill students over the past 10, 20 years have gone on to be professional musicians and professional performers. The quality of musician that comes from our academy is absolutely superb. And there's no wonder that so many of them have gone on to have fantastic careers in the industry. 
Also, even if you don't want to be a musician in the future, music is a highly desirable subject for employers. So what that means is that you can have people who work in loads and loads of different industries, in banks, in restaurants, in healthcare, in, you know, in all different sort of fields. And But because you're a musician, because you've shown the dedication it takes and the skill it takes to become a musician, they'll see that and go, well, this person is clearly really, really committed and has got loads of skills that they're going to be able to translate to our industry. So it actually provides even more than you first think. How is this course going to be assessed? Well, as I've said, 60% of the course is non-exam. It's coursework and it's practical coursework. So 30% is performing music. You will perform two pieces of music, one by yourself, one with a group, and you'll get a grade for that piece of, for those two pieces of music that you perform. That can be on any instrument. Um, you can sing or now you can actually DJ um, as well as some other different options that involve music technology as well. Composing music. So you will also compose, create two of your own pieces of music using our specialist software in school. One of them will be your own choice. One of them will be in response to what we call a brief, which is when they give you an idea to what to write about and you have to follow that with your own piece of music. And finally, the last 40% is one paper that is all listening. OK, so you sit down, you will hear eight pieces of music and you'll answer some questions about those eight pieces of music. Two of those are pieces of music that you'll have studied in a bit more detail. At the moment, one of those is Africa by Toto, the famous pop song from the 80s. And we really explore those pieces of music practically as well. So we're playing them and we're engaging with them in a really practical way right throughout the course. Through um, why this is going to be such a, an excellent subject for you. Thank you very much.